So last time I made a video about uh, talking to Bitsat aspirants who came to Bitscoa to answer their Bitsat exam. So, so I'm going to do the same thing again. I've come back to campus after my second year and um, compres. And uh, yes, let's talk to a few aspirants about how their exam was. Let's go. Okay. So what is your name and did you answer J E means? Yeah. So my name is Adip Kukarkar and I had answered J E at both the sessions. What do you think was the difficulty of your Bitsat shift uh, as compared to your J E shift? Uh, the Bitsat paper is quite easy as compared to the J E, but the number of questions are much more. Most of the uh, subjects they were like basically the same. Only the difference is English that you have. That is a different thing. Yeah. And uh, this time we didn't have much calculation, so it was much easier. How do you rate the difficulty level of the individual subjects as compared to J E Maths? Like easy, moderate, difficult. So Maths I found a little tougher because some problems I could not solve integrals, and uh, Physics was much easier because uh, there weren't many uh, questions to solve as such. But and Chemistry was the easiest because most of it was theory based from the NCERT textbook. Hmm. Any advice you would like to give to people who will be answering a uh, bit sad in the uh, future shifts? Uh, just practice and uh, have. You need to develop the speed in which you solve the problem. Hmm. That is more important. Hmm. Yes. So the exam temperament is very important while you're in there. Yeah. Okay. So you need to be very focused and very you know in the zone. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Your name and did you answer J means? Yes, my name is Atharvan Naik Desa. I answered both the sessions of J mains. How do you rate this uh, Bitsat shift as compared to your J mains exams? Yeah, Bitsat is easier than J mains exam. And uh, bit said, uh, there is a time constraint yeah. basically. You have to solve fast and many yeah. because the time given to you is less and the questions are some more. Mm -hmm. So your focus should be on time. Yeah. You, and all the questions are at the base level. Okay. NCRT pinpoints like small small things mm -hmm. they ask. Mm -hmm. Like today they ask about Reynolds number, which is a very small line given in textbook. Mm -hmm. So small things they ask. How do you rate the difficulty level of um, in the individual subjects in Bitside as compared to J? As compared to J, Bitside chemistry was easier. It was just theory, no solving at all. Okay. Physics was almost the same level, mm. and math was easier. Math was easier than J. So J some math. of the important chapters that you got uh, in your shift. Yeah, I got from integrals, mm. definite integrals, especially mm. uh, differential equation. There were many questions. Mm. In chemistry, it was from uh, comp uh, we coordination compounds or complexes, mm. and physics that was on uh, your charges. Uh, your magnetic field, electric, electric field, field. your electromagnetism right. basically. Right. Right. Thank you. Thank yeah. You. Okay. So, what is your name, and did you answer J means? Uh, I am Urvi, and I answered J E mains uh, bo both the sessions. How do you rate the difficulty of your bitsat attempt as compared to your J E mains attempt? I'd say bitsat was easier. It's just a lot more questions, and uh, just the same, the same amount of time, so it's like difficult to finish all the questions. How do you rate the difficulty level of the individual subjects, Madhav? Like easy, moderate, difficult as compared to J E mains? Maths was a little easier. Hmm. Maths and uh, chemistry was like on par. Physics also was. I found it a little easier. Okay. Uh, what What were some of the important chapters that you got in your shift? Got differential equations for maths. Any uh, physics in physics? There was a lot of magnetics uh, from magnetics. Chemistry was like two one questions from like everywhere. So there was no nothing. So someone who has not done their syllabus well in chemistry would suffer. Oh, probably. Yeah. Definitely. So you need to like know everything yeah, because you know it's, it's unpredictable. Yeah, small things. Okay. Thanks, Urvi. So what are your names and did you answer J E means? Yeah, I answered J E main. My name is Har Savan. Uh, I answered J E main. So my name is Sambaji Patil. What was the difficulty level of your bit side shift as compared to the J E shift that you answered? Shift was much more um, easier compared to J E mains, and but it was very lengthy. Okay. Yeah. It was lengthy. Mm -hmm. uh, the maths part was a mm -hmm. uh, bit of a problem to me because I am not that good in maths. Good. Physics, chemistry is okay for me. Physics was easy. Mm -hmm. Chemistry was too much easy, and uh, mathematics was uh, a bit lengthy, mm -hmm. but it was easy. Uh, English and uh, logical reasoning was also easy. So, how do you rate the difficulty level of uh, the subjects? Like easy, moderate, difficult, as compared to the J E M. Physics for bit set was easier part. Chemistry, the organic part was a bit uh, difficult. Okay. Physical was very easy. The electrochemistry part came, and uh, in organic, uh, I didn't see any P block question. <laughs> Not even deep. There were many questions from physical chemistry only. Only uh, from uh, on organic chemistry, there were around four to five questions, and in mathematics, there were one to two matrices, matrices and determinants. Overall, it was more easy to model. What, what were some of the important chapters that you came across? Six. There were like uh, the eleventh part was major in this shift. I don't know why. Mechanics. Okay. Yeah, mechanics. Hmm. And twelfth uh, part, your magnetism, mm. electrostatics, mm. electro potential, mm. those things. Physical chemistry only electrochemistry thing I saw. Uh, organic, uh, your uh, hydrocarbons and all. 
those things were modern physics was not there not a single question no, 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 in uh, no, no, no. physics hmm. and also in chemistry there was nothing from uh, this nucleus atoms and nucleus and nothing apart from that did you like uh, bits goa this is the first time you came on campus yeah. right so how how is the campus would you like to come and you know be here yeah very nice you can see planes you know, flying <laughs> anytime uh nice yeah. wind also hmm. How is the overall vibe? Of yeah, the it's good, very good. good. How about you? Yeah, you liked it. Yeah, nine point five on ten. Are you kidding? Why? Why did it lose the point five marks? Uh. I don't know but just uh, 9.5 on 10. Okay. Apart from that that is pretty much it for this video. Um I hope you got some insights about uh, this year's Bitsat paper. I I hope this video helps the aspirants who are going to answer the uh, future shifts. So yeah. Apart from that if your uh, first attempt was not good, you can uh, you know always uh, make a comeback. If you want to make a comeback, go to the link in the description. go to www.fur.club. Join the best Bitsat test series, the most relevant Bitsat test series out there along with mentorship and we Bitsians will guide you. it will really help you out because we'll tell you about the mistakes that we made and uh, you will not repeat them so yeah all the best and thank you so much for watching subscribe this is just daily life